I want to welcome you back to Black Sight tonight. We're going to talk about LeBron James and Clutch Sports sending emails asking NBA writers to vote for LeBron James for MVP. First, I would like for you to subscribe to this channel. Hit that like button. Hit that notification button. But also comment on these videos. LeBron James, Clutch Sports, and the rest of that crew over there was trying to get MVP votes for LeBron James. A leaked email by Rick Bucher of SFS1, formerly of ESPN, showed that LeBron James was asking writers to vote for him. The winner of the MVP award was Mr. Jokic, the Joker. But LeBron James has been doing this for years. We were always talking about the LeBron James media industrial complex in which they protected LeBron James for the majority of his career. Basically, he either had him working on at Clutch Sports or associates of Clutch Sports of Maverick Carter and that whole team over there. So what's going on right now is that he's finally being exposed. And I'm glad Rick Bucher is doing this. If he's paying for these votes, we don't know. But we know that Adam Silver is not going to investigate LeBron James. LeBron James is basically the standard barrier of the NBA. He's now the leading scorer. He has four championships. And he would not want to destroy one of the greatest players of the NBA uh, career. But we also have to look at I believe that the man is using PEDs. Adam Silver won't look into that. As long as LeBron James can still wear that Laker uniform and run up and down the court and score, they really don't care. It's all about the money. But to have that much power, to have that much arrogance and narcissism, to send an email across to all the writers basically saying, you're on my team or off my team, but please vote for me. Who does that? Who even calls himself the GOAT other than a narcissist or someone who truly believes he's above anybody else and in a, in a player who refuses to take any accountability for his actions? You see, Clutch Sports hasn't said nothing. LeBron James hasn't said something because they're out here working to promote his name, and he's 40 years old almost. This is utterly ridiculous, and Adam Silver needs to step out and say something about it, but you know he won't do nothing. You know, our last commissioner that we had, if he was here, he would have stepped all over LeBron James for this incident. He would have said this was unacceptable, and damn near, would have brought him up to New York to speak to him in his office. Something Adam Silver wouldn't do. Matter of fact, Adam Silver goes to LeBron James' office. That's how embarrassing the NBA is. And this is why their ratings is starting to fall off the cliff. Because people see that there's no accountability in the NBA. Especially for LeBron James, the fake GOAT. And that's what I'm going to call him as long as he try to present himself as the GOAT. I would love to hear your comments in the comments section. I want to thank you for listening to Black Side Sports. Hope you survived this channel. Smash that like button, but also share this video.